Welcome to Speed Passions. This is a video to show you how to using the Revent on Wi-Fi module to input device to changing the ESU firmware. Now here's the video step to change the Revent on ESU firmware. You can see on the status menu. Way now which is sort of modified B and G. Let's get on the left button, Options. Now you can see the screen is Update Firmware Sections. Select Update Firmware, click OK. Now you can see the menu of our firmware selections. We are using Sample to change the software to Drift Mode Firmware. Select the V10, click OK. After Confirm, you can see there's a state of cost to show you how many percentage of the new firmware transfer from the Apple's device to your ESC. During the meantime, please do not turn the power off either app's device or the event on ESC. That will be quite a damage for the ESC. During the firmware transfer update process, if unfortunately the power is off or the update is break down, please make sure you use the smart LED program card with the USB device connect with the PC, Win 7 or XP system using a PC interface software to connect with your event on USC and then re upload the new firmware again. This will be enabled to recover the damage which has happened. After the firmware is successfully transferred, we're doing a loading data sections one. This will be only doing one. This is a confirm that new firmware has been successfully transferred to your ESC. After the update firmware success, please click OK. Now you can click on the right button to state the page, which showing the ESC firmware versions when now is to V10. That has been successfully showing your new software is able to use. Please look, after you have been successfully updated new firmware to ESC, please reset your ESC and radio once, which is the calibrations for your radios. Speed up. Please go to ESC setting and select ESC connections to off. This will be disable the Wi-Fi module with the Apple's device then you will freely to set your ESC and radio calibrations again. After the event on app's ESC connections is shown off, you start the radio and ESC setting process. Once the radio and ESC setting process is done, you are ready to use your new ESC firmware and enjoy good driving performance. Thank you very much.